Hello everybody, today's episode of the A to Z of Minecraft mobs, we're going to have a look at magma cubes. And we've got a big one in here behind us. He spawned naturally, which is amazing, because uh, they're quite rare. Now he's going to hurt me if I let him get to me. Okay, we'll see that any second now. Oh boy, okay, don't let me fall off the edge, that's not going to go well. Okay, so this guy is a big one. And there are three sizes, big, small, and tiny. Now, size-wise, we're going to say this guy is a 4, the small is a 2, and the tiny is a 1. Now, they jump around every 2 to 6 seconds, make that noise, which, uh, as you can hear, they don't make any noise when they're idle. So, if, the, if he didn't see me, which I'd be within 16 blocks of him for him to find me, uh, <laughs> He'd just be maybe standing around. He might have a, a wander around himself. They don't take fall damage, but they uh, they don't pathfind either. So if I was deleted over here, in it, it could fall down off a, a high gap or anything like that. Just a couple, a couple more torches there, pop them out. Okay. Come on. Now, as you can see, they're a red and black squelchy body. <laughs> and they've got orange and yellow eyes. Now, as I say, the size is important because <laughs> in this case, each one has a relative, uh, what would you say, attack strength. And they also have armor points. So a big guy like this, size 4, how we uh, determine his attack strength is we take his size and we add two. So he's got an attack strength of four plus two, which is six. So the small guy would have, uh, he would be a size two plus two, he'd have an attack strength of four. And the tiny, being a size one, would have an attack strength of, anybody? Come on, one and two, <laughs> three. Now, if I hit this guy or attack him, He's going to split into one or four of the next size down. Oh, don't, will I? Okay. There we go. You determine his armor points by tripling his size. So three fours are twelve. Take that. Now he's split into three. Of, oh, he's split into four of the small ones. Okay. Now the big one, as I say, has armor points of twelve. And he has uh, an attack strength of six. Okay, now, his health points, the big guy, before we got him down, that's what I was trying to determine. <laughs> his health points are his size squared, so four fours, 16. So he has got 16 hearts, where these guys being a, a two, two twos, a four. So they've got four health points, and a tiny, well, he's only a one, because one squared is one. Ooh, we've got some lag there. Okay, let's take one of these guys out. Smack, there we go. And see, he's split down into the into the tiny ones now. So we've got the small and the tiny. And the small can do damage as well. And how do we determine damage again, anybody? Their attack strength is their size, 2, plus 2. So they've got an attack strength of 4. And these little guys have an attack strength of 3 being one plus two, okay? So they're easy enough to take out. Now they drop something called magma cream, but not the tiny guys, just the small ones or the big ones. So you've got a 25% chance of getting a magma cream from these guys. We might be lucky. I'll just take this guy out as well. No. Okay, we're left with one more small and the rest are tiny. And as you can see, we've got plenty of tinies. There, yeah, we, got, we got a magma cream, okay. There we go. That's a magma cream there. So that's good. I suppose that's a scene we had four. There was a good chance that we would get at least one. And they will drop somewhere between zero and one. But as I say, it's a 25% chance of getting a magma cream. We've got plenty of these guys, but they are easy to dispatch. They're just quite annoying. And they will knock you back. And they do damage. So be careful when you're standing on the edge. <laughs> their height jump and their distance jump is all relative to their size. As you can see, the big one jumps the highest. 
Likewise, then the small one jumps the next highest and the tiniest, well, the tiniest jump. <laughs> so they jump, being this four, jumps the height of four. And this one jumps the height of two and this one jumps the height of one. They jump their length multiplied by 1.5. So this guy can get there very quickly. <laughs> ah, I'm in a hole. They drop XP. The big one drops four, the small one drops two, and the tiny one drops one. Just like their size. <laughs> they deal two strikes per second. So they're twice as fast dealing a strike as an Enderman or a... What do you call them little scuttery things that run around on the floor? Silverfish. <laughs> so if you let this guy hit you, he will deal damage fairly well and fairly fast see that that's pretty good <laughs> that'll do it <laughs> so with this extra fast strike these guys can deal quite the damage in a short amount of time so you need to stay a good distance away from them and uh, make your attack that way and don't let these guys get in the way <laughs> he actually killed believe it or not he actually killed the big one that was here a minute ago. There you go. That's Magma Cubes, and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. I better run. <laughs> Bye.